Hi, this is Pastor Harley Wheeler with the Broadway United Methodist Church. Today my devotion is out of Genesis chapter 2, verse 7. It's about the creation of humankind. It says, Then the Lord God formed the man out of dust from the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life, and the man became a living creature. It's a beautiful picture of creation. You realize this, this God who can do anything with a wave of his mighty hand uh, is down there forming the man with his hands, lifting him close to his presence, his very face, and breathes into him the breath of life, and thus we become living beings. And so this is who you are, precious to God, made by his hand. Um, the idea of you living was something he had in view from the creation of the, of the universe. Now also, um, the beginning of the year, it's uh, January 3rd, or 4th actually, and I want you to consider, my friends, that, uh, that you know, we've perhaps begun some resolutions, and then perhaps already found that they're harder to keep. Well, I, I remember a preacher uh, spoke to my youth group when I was leading it years ago, and we had talked about some re resolutions for the new year, and and he was a big, you know, it's all grace and faith, and and um, we're we're lost, lost souls and lost beings without God. So I don't see any any hope in in your project to make yourself better. Well, he's right in one way. Uh, we need to remember not the the despair that we are lost beings without God. We are. But also that we are people designed to live by God's very spirit and breath. Uh, so no, true, no uh, resolution is gonna, gonna stand without God's grace. But with God's grace, many things will happen in our lives that are amazing. Many sins uh, and things that abound us will no longer have power over us will no longer be significant in our life, and that is because of the grace of this God, who uh, is the author of our life, and who will see us through to sanctification, to, to true holiness. And so, yes, we are dust and can't depend much on our own effort, but we also are, are molded by, from that dust by God. And so whatever you're aiming to do, whatever you have hopes for yourself, turn it over to God. Allow Him to be the source of what you're doing and you'll discover the strength there that you need to see. So be blessed today. Amen.